No big party tonight. Yes, ma'am. Seriously, Mac. I don't know what's next, you know? We're all still gonna be friends. Always, no matter what. I know it's your big reunion weekend, but am I required to be excited about it too? A little enthusiasm would be nice. I can't believe you talked me into going to this. Sam might be coming. Dare I ask about Marty? I haven't seen these friends in about 25 years. Hard to believe it's been so long. The last time I was here, we were being chased by the police. Everyone was categorized back then. Sportos, motorheads, geeks, weebies, wastoids. To another generation of Brentford boys. You guys really can <laughs> Do me a favor, run inside and grab some paper towels. <laughs> I wonder if Sam and Casey are gonna hit it off. I don't think anyone's looking to rekindle the flame. I think about you. You do? Yes. Poor Sam and misguided Casey. Oh, and that dick? I don't make any money. I don't make enough money. I have never made any money. So, uh, things have been going well for you since we graduated. Can't complain. Could be worse. Let's not forget, the alcoholic. And thus began my rapid descent towards rock bottom. Oh, and you guys, with all that you've been through, I mean, it must be hard. Every time you go to work, she's there. How many times do I have to tell you? Nothing happened. Tonight, let's celebrate where we are. I'm only here to rub my success in people's faces. Wow. What is so wrong with your life? Why did you break up with me? Maybe I'd be happy if you saw me for who I really am like you used to. Just stop and take a look at your life. It's beautiful. There's something very wrong with both of you. You know I needed to come home, right? Happy 25, buddy. How you doing? I've been great. You? Uh -huh. I'm good. Yeah. Really good. <laughs>